Katie. And I'm David. And we are here to tell you about an opportunity for free camping at Pocahontas State Park near Richmond, Virginia. Pocahontas, that's a great park. Anyone would love to camp there for free. And we have managed to do some camping at Pocahontas for free. And we'd like to share some ideas about how you can do the same thing. Um, we're full-timers. We've been uh, full-timing for 16 years, but the first 10 of those were on a sailboat. Our last six have been in an RV, and it's those opportunities we're talking about here at Pocahontas, obviously. You know, when we were sailing, and we had some great times, but I really missed the opportunity to give back to others. And that's what brought us back multiple times to Pocahontas, because we were we started off hosting there, and, and then... Uh, just fell in love with the park. Our family's nearby, but that's that became only part of it. There's a, a beautiful campground, a lovely place to stay. There's miles of hiking trails. Um, the staff is just amazing. They are so friendly and so outgoing. And You know, I'm not too much into mountain biking, but they've got world-class mountain biking trails. In yes. fact, the Eastern, the Paralyzed Veterans of America make that their home base for Abs the East Coast. Absolutely. And... Um, there are three lakes, a, a pool complex that our grandkids love. It's a wonderful park, a place you want to come back to. They even have lots of concerts in the outdoor amphitheater. So uh, it's hard to it's hard to encapsulate everything they've got going on there. But you're here probably because you want to know about the free camping. So what we do is we when we were there, we learned about some group cabin sites that are unique within the Virginia State Park system that exist at Pocahontas, but they needed some help, and we came up with a solution. You know, I, I, want, I want to show folks the uh, those group cabins, and they can see how they're falling into disrepair, and then the concept we had to actually offer folks a free campsite to help us stabilize these cabins and, and save them for future generations. So, so let, me, let me show them pictures of uh, the group cabins. Mm -hmm. Presently, I'm sitting in one of the six group cabin sites which were originally built in the Swift Creek Demonstration Area by the Civilian Conservation Corps, better known as the CCC, in the 1930s as part of President Roosevelt's plan to help the nation recover from the Great Depression. Here I learned the plight of the group cabins. These cabins were built by the young men of the CCC as a way for groups such as scouts, YMCA and churches to gain access to the outdoors. In fact, many of them are still used that way today. As Pocahontas has the largest number of CCC buildings of any Virginia State Park listed on the National Historic Registry and the only CCC group cabins in all of Virginia, their limited budget hasn't been able to keep up with the maintenance. In an effort to save them for future generations, Cabin Work Week was launched. So far, the response has been overwhelming in that 30 to 40 volunteers are coming at the end of October to spend a week beginning the effort to stabilize them. We, we want, want you to, to be, be part, part of, of our team. team. Let's talk a little bit about the, quote, work that, uh, that, that we do. In general, we're stabilizing the cabins Monday through Friday for about six hours a day. Most of the days we even get a free lunch. Absolutely. <laughs> um, good lunches at that. Um, the type of, of work we do is carpentry work, we do roofing work, we do screen repair, and we do a lot of painting. If you have those skills and can join us, great. If you don't have the skills, a desire to work and learn, that's fine too. We have a number of experienced uh, individuals in each one of those skills that's more than willing to take uh, an interested new person and uh, help, help you gain some skills. Yep, they're a great team. Yep. Yeah, I think our carpenters also like the fact that we use pressure treated rough cut lumber in order to maintain that historic look also. Yes, yes, and it the uh, the finished product is, is really a transformation so it's it's a, it's a joy to uh, to see the, the camp the cabins at the end of the week. Yep. At the same point, it's not all work and no play. Absolutely not. We we have the we have fun while we work, but after hours we have a lot of activities. We want you to see the park, enjoy the park, and want to come back. 
So we'll have uh, ranger-led activities like geocaching and hiking on the trails and, and other interpretive events. But then we also have campfires, and uh, which you could include a s'mores competition where they got really creative the last few years. Yeah, uh, th those are really good competitions. <laughs> Absolutely. I, I'm not sure what our volunteers like the most, the s'mores competition or, or the archery. archery. Yeah, they do archery competition also. Yes, and there's also um, there's also a lots of opportunities for you to explore on your own, but on the weekend, in between the two weeks, we are part of a volunteer appreciation picnic, which includes all of the volunteers that come and work at Pocahontas State Park, and they have an amazing spread for the volunteers, and you get to see what other people are doing in the park as yeah. well. There'll be over 100 volunteers there. And, yes. and they always have some little things that they uh, they give the volunteers right. in terms of recognition and door prizes and door prizes. Yes, yeah, so it's it's a fun event, and we make sure that our team is uh, is invited and 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 comes if they're interested. Yeah. When you talk about earning things, it's not just the free work at camping as we stabilize the cabins, not just the door prizes at the picnic, <laughs> but, but the Virginia <laughs> State Park system has a volunteer benefit uh, system where they you earn points towards things uh, starting with uh, just a t-shirt but it can go to annual passes for the all the Virginia State Parks or even a lifetime pass uh, which you can only earn volunteering and you earn points towards future free camping. Camping in any of the Virginia State Parks. Not just Pocahontas. We'll put a so. link down below to the uh, to all the benefits to the that, benefit space. that you that you can kind of study that on your own. The other thing that we've appreciated is that our volunteers enjoy it enough that they want to come back, and that part of that was recognized by us being awarded the 2020 Virginia State Park Volunteer Group Project of the Year. So that's we a, were that's across all of the Virginia State yes, Parks. Yes, we were we were incredibly honored by that, and the team really really does do a lot so it was it was nice to, to get the recognition yeah. we, we've uh, we always accept donations but we've been we've been blessed with a, a number of financial donations that really make a difference for us we started off with virginia preservation we had a number of donations from the virginia garden club for a couple of years to keep us going and last year we were especially honored by lowe's lowe's was celebrating its 100th birthday and they selected 100 community projects across the country to honor. Ours was one of the 100 projects. Not only did they help us financially, but local Lowe's employees came and spent two days uh, working, working on, on stabilizing the cabinets with us. So they made a difference, and the Virginia State Park, or Department of Conservation and Recreation Director Baker, came and visited us to see what was going on and was impressed enough that she made monies available to us to help buy supplies for this year and tools that will make the work even go smoother in the 2020 project season. So we have plenty of tools, we have plenty of supplies, we we have a number of volunteers that come back and know what we're doing, but we, we need additional. Yes, we want you to join us this October. We hope to see you. The, the way to sign up We'll put a link down below, but you contact the Pocahontas Volunteer Coordinator. Mm -hmm. uh, her email address will be there. Uh, if you have an issue with that, you can call Pocahontas State Park near Richmond, Virginia, and ask for the Volunteer Coordinator in, in order to start the process of getting you signed up to be part of the team. So we want to see you this fall. I hope you that we piqued your interest, and we hope to hear from you. It'll be great to camp with you.